Welcome everybody to the seasonal diet, eating what our ancestors ate, when they ate it, like we were evolved to do. Creatine, one of my favorite supplements. Was it in our ancestral diet? If so, when? Well, the answer is, of course not, and also, of course. So creatine was discovered and isolated in the 1800s, and in recent decades it has really been made into a supplement uh, used in the bodybuilding community, and just a, a, a general good uh, supplement that improves athletic performance. So, of course, ancient humans were not taking the supplement like this, but... Of course, you can find this in food. Creatine is in food, mostly red meat and fish. Problem is, most creatine supplements recommend uh, 5 grams a day at least, and that is anywhere from 3 to 5 fucking pounds of meat in a day, which is impossible to eat, at least on a daily basis. Or is it? Now, nobody really eats that much meat today, and besides maybe a 400 pound strong man, <laughs> but nobody else uh, before in history really ate like that. But there is maybe some of our ancestors that did eat three to five pounds of meat a day. Um, that sounds a hell of a lot like our earliest hunter-gatherer ancestors, doesn't it? Let's just say you were hunting, uh, maybe a tribe of 20, 30 people, None of you had eaten for a few days and you just uh, hunted down a massive bison or even a mammoth. Now, this was at a time before we had freezers, <laughs> and even back to a time before humans uh, salted or smoked their meats to preserve it, possibly. This could go back to very, very ancient times. Stone Age, hunter-gatherer days. So yeah, I'd say they probably could eat five pounds of meat in a day there. In addition, Early humans ate a lot more organs, like the kidney and liver, which have even more creatine than regular meat. So yeah, this is actually totally possible for ancient hunter-gatherers to get 5 grams of creatine. Is it for us today? Mm, I don't know about you, but I'm sure as hell <laughs> not rich enough to eat 3 to 5 pounds of meat and organs a day. Uh, and I don't hunt regularly either, so yeah, I do take some creatine, but... Only for certain periods, like for example, simulating an ancient hunt like it would have been done in ancient times. I maybe have some creatine every once in a while after a very hard training day or possibly I eat it for up to a week like humans might have eaten like a lot of meat in the winter high festival or something like that. But yeah, I do not take creatine year-round, it's just not sustainable and not something that humans have had in their diet regularly like a bodybuilder or a strongman might be taking today.